Police are certain the man wanted for killing five people and terrorizing a South Carolina town is dead. The investigation can prove that um, Mr. Burris was was near all three crime scenes on the date and the times of the murder. Patrick Tracy Burris's alleged killing spree came to an end 30 miles away from Gaffney, near Gastonia, North Carolina. In the middle of the night, a couple spotted a suspicious SUV and called police. It kind of favored the vehicle that they were looking for. Burris gave police a fake name, then pulled a gun on officers when they tried to arrest him for a parole violation. It really shocked me when the shots started going off, and I said, you know, this guy's got to be crazy to shoot at three police officers. One officer was wounded inside the house, but police fired back and killed Burris. Investigators say the gun Burris used was the same one used by the Gaffney serial killer. We're still trying to ascertain as to what connection he might have had or why he might have targeted these individuals. Police don't know Burris's motive, but say the 41-year-old has a 25-page rap sheet. The criminal justice system is on the need to explain why this individual is out on the street. Investigators will also be trying to retrace Burris's movements to determine whether there are even more victims. Susan Roberts, CBS News, Gastonia, North Carolina.